Hey guys, this is Mallory, and today I'm bringing you a question and answer video. I'm going to end up having three different videos because I've had a lot of questions be asked. And today's video is going to be gaming and Xbox related questions. And to help me with my video, I have my best friend Tiffany here to help me out. So Tiffany, go ahead and say hi. What up? Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and get into the first question. So Tiffany's going to be reading off the questions to me, and I'm obviously going to be answering them. So Tiffany, go ahead and ask the first question. Sammy Wilkman wants to know, what do you like the most about gaming? The thing I like the most about gaming is I obviously love playing video games. If I didn't, I wouldn't be playing them. Uh, but the thing I like the most about gaming is getting to know new people and having fun playing with people. So that's what I like the most about gaming is getting to know new people. The second question is from Sammy Wilkman as well, and he wants to know, will you play games when you're 80 years old? The answer to that question is, if the nursing home allows video games and there is a system out when I'm 80 years old, and if I even make it to 80 years old, the answer is probably yes. I will be playing games when I'm 80 years old. The next question is from NateGuy941. How did you get into gaming? Um, I was basically born into a family that played games. I don't exactly remember how I got into gaming. I remember we had this one game on the Super Nintendo that you played as like a bird. And you flew eggs to a nest and there was like lava and stuff. I don't even know what it was. It was fun when I was like four. Um, and then I got into like Donkey Kong and Zelda and Mario oh, yeah. <laughs> and all that and from then on I was just in love with video games and and all of that so yeah that's how I got into gaming was just basically being born into a family that played games. Aaron Kutenhayo wants to know, will you ever play Halo? Um, I have Halo 3 and I, I used to have Halo Reach, but that's kind of irrelevant. I, I have Halo 3. Um, I will play Halo, but only if I have other friends online that are playing Halo and that want to play Halo. It's not one of those games that I typically play by myself or on a regular basis. But yeah, I'll play Halo. Exorcist wants to know, how did you get into girl gaming? Um... Well, when I hit about 12 or 13 years old, I grew a pair of boobs, and that's how I got into girl gaming. <laughs> Jetpack wants to know, do you plan on hosting open lobbies? Um, I don't ever really do, like, open lobbies. I think once I get more subscribers and, like, more active followers that, that want to play with me, I'll host open lobbies. For the time being, anytime I need players or anything on Call of Duty or anything, I post on Twitter. So if you guys haven't followed me on Twitter yet, I'll leave my link in the description so you guys can go follow me. And whenever I want to play with you guys, I'm going to post on there or possibly my Facebook fan page. You guys can can let me know and I'll invite you. I bounce wants to know, are you going to change your gamer tag? <laughs> <laughs> I really wanted to change my gamer tag. Um, actually, I really kind of want to change it because apparently there's some big deal with having numbers in your gamer tag. And when I made my gamer tag, it was Mama 2011, and the reason that's what it is is because my name is obviously Mallory, and Mau Mau has been my nickname ever since I was a little kid. And 2011 was the year that I graduated high school, <laughs> and I made my gamer tag almost three years ago and it's pretty much been the same thing since I made it and I've obviously graduated from high school now so I need to change it to something else and I actually have a few people that call me meow meow like a cat like meow meow because meow meow sounds like meow like a cat <laughs> and Whoa. Uh, what too many cats <laughs> too many cats <laughs> 
Um, so that's what I wanted to change it to is Meow Meow, but that gamer tag is taken. So, damn you ever has that gamer tag. Um, that's kind of what I wanted to change it to, but it was taken. So I'm gonna have to think of something better. So for the time being, no, I'm not changing my gamer tag. IMG does it. What is a good headset? Uh, I can't really answer that fully because I've only ever used one headset. I have Turtle Beach's X11 headset, and, um, I don't know, they're pretty good. I like having a headset. I'm not, like, I don't really care how good they are. I just, I like having Turtle Beach's. It's a lot easier to play at night without waking people up because of game sounds. And plus, it does help you out a little bit better because you can sound whore. And that's really good for search and destroy, which is my favorite game type, as I've said 20 million times. So, yeah. Um, any headset will probably be good enough. Vixen wants to know, if you could be any video game character, who would you be and why? The obvious answer to that question is Princess Zelda. Because she hooks up with Link, and that's the love of my life. Let's get it on. <laughs> D-Tiger Dude, what's your favorite gun in Call of Duty? Uh, I'll go ahead and answer from pretty much every Call of Duty. In Call of Duty 4, my favorite gun was the G36C. Modern Warfare 2 was the ACR. Uh, World at War was probably the PPSH. I'm picking the newbiest weapons possible, if you didn't know. Um, and in Black Ops, I'm gonna have to go with probably the AK-47. Altruit, what's the hardest thing about being a girl gamer, and is it worth the sexual harassment? The worst thing about being a girl gamer is obviously, as you said, like the sexual harassment and the inappropriate comments uh, but, yeah, it's worth it, because I love video games, and I'm not gonna let a bunch of trolls mess up the game for me. So, yeah, it's worth it. Alright, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video, and that was just part one of my question and answer video. Make sure you look for the next two parts, which will be out probably sometime before this week is done. Tiffany, go ahead and say goodbye. Goodbye. And, as always, this is Mau Mau, and I will talk to you later.